hi there this is going to be a general reading and we are just going to dive right in and see what comes out okay <sighs> lots happening energetically of course we have been under quarantine um in hawaii it was just announced today that our stay at home order is extended through june 30th which i am all for i am not trying to rush out there into the world that's just me I mean, take this time right now to rest and retreat, you know? It's kind of like our time right now to heal, to exhale. I don't know. It just has this feeling to it of like it being on purpose for us to take some time out. It's just going to be different for everybody, but it just has that feeling. Four of spring, be grateful you have much to celebrate. Drop feelings of peace and happiness, a contented personal life. This is the four of wands. Oh, marriage union. Mm, mm, mm. All right, let's get right into it. This is the light seer's deck. What is this? Is that the sun? Holy shit balls. Right off the bat, the sun. The sun is healing i just didn't i just say that like during our time in quarantine to like retreat and heal and such it's like the sun energy is magnetic also she's being pulled gravitationally to her person him to her also it's like the two of them are just zzz. And in this particular deck, if you look on her skirt, she has a lightning bolt here, which I noticed, you know, a while ago on one of my lives, XI underscore Missy underscore XI, if you want to follow me on Instagram. And it's just like a lightning bolt, like zzz. It's magnetic. It's electric. Boogie, woogie, woogie, woogie. The sun is about enlightenment, but the sun is also about truth. The Hierophant, Taurus energy. It's marriage and commitment, Taurus energy. I mean, excuse me, the Hierophant. It's this screaming, being gravitationally pulled to a person that you're kind of like meant to be with. It's also like ascension with the Hierophant being in this card. You see how it's like kind of going up the stairs? It's ascension rising up with the sun also yeah breaking dawn six of cups could be someone that you know from the past six of cups here can also be memories i feel like you oh my good good oh my oh oh my god becky it's the ten of cups this is emotional bliss happily ever after having it all it came out with this particular card the page of cups but that's not what's important in this particular deck okay the light seers deck which i got as a gift i received it in the mail after i channeled when pigs fly this is the card when fucking pigs fly uh, it's this general energy of it's incredible it's beyond belief it will only happen when pigs fly you better run outside check outside your window i think i saw a pig fly by it's incredible it's beyond belief it's there's no way how could it be it's this feeling of like how did this happen how did our paths cross it has that kind of a feeling to it of like how it's insane this is like a, a, in your wildest dreams it's this feeling of like how the fuck could this be it's that incredible the owls very wise old souls very ascended master energy here. Two of you guys come into your ascended master energy. That's how you get all this incredible shit in, and it's when pigs fly. It's because you've locked into this energy space of attracting miracles and it is this whole, it's when pigs fly, but it's not necessarily when pigs fly, it's when you lock into that energy. 
into that frequency. Isn't that incredible? It's unbelievable. Beyond your wildest dreams. It's just like... Willy Wonka ain't gonna have shit on this, honey. In the pathway. It's a fork in the road. It's a choice that needs to be made. For some of you, it's a choice between new and old. Whether that means a person or the life, your life, the old or the new. Courthouse. Something here is legal. Somebody here could be under legal separation. They could start to go under the, the process of divorce. Has a feeling of like divorce though because the Ten of Cups here with the, the Hierophant indicates like marriage or commitment and it, it feels like it's some kind of like a divorce or a breakup. Concern and bad health. I mean, obvious. <sighs> bad health thing right now is a whole damn pandemic that we're going through right now whether you believe in the actual virus or you don't as i say it doesn't matter what you believe in it matters that something's happening out there that is causing so many deaths and it doesn't matter about the specific oh it's a virus it's real it's not it doesn't matter it's what's what what matters to me is that whatever's going on out there shit ain't safe and there's concern for this I feel like somebody here is concerned about the, the pandemic because they're feeling like, does this mean that they don't get their chance with you? Is what it feels like. Or, 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 or this can't manifest and happen is what it's, you know, it's kind of like nervousness about that, about like, oh my gosh, but like now what, if, now what happens? Holy shit, the heart chakra. Turning on your heart light. I've channeled that before several months ago maybe last year i don't remember and it's coming up again everything comes through us here i've talked about that since at least 2018 right it's not me coming up with something new it's not oh missy discovered it it's what it is <laughs> i'm just relaying it and reminding people again it's it's something that is what it is everything comes through us here through the heart chakra it's many people have been purging and that's what is being healed here during this time of quarantine it's like you have to open your heart to receive this amazing thing that is like so insane that it, it's like when pigs fly temptation Tess. I just saw Tess in my head. Oh, geez, harmony. Look at that. You have deception and envy and obstacles and challenges. That goes in with the temptation. Could be karmic situations. This could be addictions to drugs, sex, alcohol, things of that sort. Anything that would be kind of like devil like energy, right? Number six, harmony, is basically the lovers. Gemini season's right around the corner. Two people coming together because it's time. Because they've both locked into their ascended master's energy, so their souls are calling out to each other. It's almost as if, too, like the heart chakra lights up and puts out a signal you you know what i just saw in my head you know like how if you you're like at a bank or something and like you're getting robbed and they have like the secret like button here and when it's pressed no one knows it's like silent so like the robber like has no clue like they don't even know it's like you didn't even know that your heart chakra light went on or something it's like it's like you just you didn't do it on purpose it's just like it happens it's like natural like it just turns on when you like do the work and like hit a particular frequency. Authority, there's a freaking emperor. He just keeps coming up nonstop. Aries energy. But the emperor is coming in. He's the shot caller. You're going to have many options. Obviously, right? When it rains, it pours. It's raining, man. Hallelujah. It's raining, man. But. The emperor is going to come forward and he's going to 
He's gonna conquer them all. He is going to, this is Sparta, and claim. He's gonna stake his claim. That's how you're gonna know it's your person because he just comes forward and he, he doesn't hesitate, although you don't know how long it took for him to get to that point. Maybe he's been watching you for a minute, that's why, right? And it took him a minute to, to gain the courage or it could be what I've been feeling for a minute and I also felt this earlier on when I was on Instagram Live where he didn't get involved or step forward yet because he was kind of waiting to see how things play out with all these other dudes that are coming up to you and the emperor is not going to get involved unless he has to because he already knows all these dudes that are coming forward is like meh. They're not going to last or they are just not for you. They're not real competition. Steps forward when real competition comes into play or when it's time. He's just so strategic and so seasoned. He's also very stoic. He might not have a lot to say, but when he talks, you're going to listen. Stand your ground. He's going to stake his claim. Not in like a, a narcissistic type of way either about staking his claim. It's not. It's just the emperor is going to say this is what i want you're what i want the emperor could honestly shock the shit out of you too because it could be someone that you absolutely do not expect or has suspected all along but thought was too good to be true or thought it would never happen but also at the same time i feel that when the emperor comes through he's going to come through with a very solid offer meaning he's not just going to say hi would you like to go out for coffee he's going to say hi i'm you're the one fertility will you look at what's lit up this is the empress see that turning on your heart light oh boy 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 hmm I don't know what to tell you. I think for some of you too, you guys know who it is, but like it's, you you wrote it off. I, the dream thing is gonna happen like tremendously. Last night I dreamt of a person and I've never been in a relationship with him, but like I know him, you know? And I was just like, he could like totally be an option, but like we're not like that. Like we don't talk like that. We just like don't even have each other's numbers. But then I thought, why am I dreaming about him? Again, it's not even like the first time either. And it's just like, what the hell? I don't know, maybe the dream state, you know, maybe the subconscious is bringing two people together. New beginnings. Oh, boy. This fairy godmother heralds the joyous news of a new baby or the birth of a cherished idea. Protect and nurture your ideas as you would a baby. And then you just had fertility, a birth of a new cycle. And then you also have lost and found. What was once lost is about to be found. Thanks to the lost and found fairy. Sometimes she can help us find things we never even realized were lost. Why do I feel like that's your person and you getting back together? Little do you know that you have been separated for some of you. Maybe it's been 17 lifetimes that you guys have been trying to get together. Or back to get the bottom of the fucking deck's healing. I said that. Now is a time for you to give or receive healing. Everyone has a natural ability to heal others. Yes, even you. I'm telling you, during quarantine time, this was a time for healing, mass healing. And it was just what people needed also in order to kind of change and, and morph into this new version of themselves in this new earth. It's almost like because the new earth is so different it's new we needed this time to kind of go within and purge or heal or cry or laugh or create or just simply rest it was like essential it's like the caterpillar in the cocoon is what it is this is incredible energy and i love it makes me nervous though i'm not gonna lie it does make me nervous only because of the sheer simple fact that when it talks about when pigs fly, I think it's going to have this shock factor. It's a wow factor. It may just be like you, it, you, you may not even believe it at first too. Like honestly, you just might be like, oh yeah, it's full of shit. Something's in between my good tarot cards. Hold on. My cards are a little messed up here. 
trying to organize some things so I know what to do. Are we gonna do good tarot? I guess we are. Get a few more cards out here. That's too much. All right, Spirit, come on. Just a few cards, please. So we can understand what's happening. Messenger of air. Oh, there is a definite message coming. Gosh, damn, it's the fortune's wheel. The wheel of fortune. Tell them what they've won. Oh my God, it's when pigs fucking fly. Wait till you hear what you won. Oh my God, I have, I, 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 I Wait till you hear what you've won. Oh my God, it's just like chills. <sighs> Tennis completion, you've completed a huge level. I'm telling you, people have locked into their ascended master's energy is what it really feels like strength. Number eight, this could be Leo energy, but this is having the strength to overcome something and then the freaking hierophant again. Oh, something's under it. Why does the Justice Libra energy keep popping up? It was hidden. Okay, so you have strength, which is Leo. You have justice, which is Libra. This is also balance, but this is also karma, right? This is your payout. Your karmic payout is when pigs fly. That's what it's going to be like. It's going to be like, oh, yeah, all right. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be with him when pigs fly. Oh, yeah, right. I'm going to have that happen to me when pigs fly. And pigs fucking fly. Look at the Hierophant, how gorgeous she is. It's like a high priestess yeah, on this deck. It's Taurus energy, but look at her. I this she feels like Hikati. Goddess Hikati for some reason. I've been feeling her for a second, kind of recently. I've been feeling goddess Hikati. Um it's marriage and union. It's it, it's it, it's I can't even talk. It's hand fasting. I don't know if it means that you guys have hand fasted in the past or if you guys will be hand fasting in this life. Not just having a just a total traditional wedding. You guys might have a traditional wedding and then hand fast in this lifetime too. Or these are two people coming back together that have already had a hand fasting ceremony is what it feels like. She's overseeing things here, this high priestess, this this goddess energy temptation again with the devil you have it twice be very careful if not this could scream uh, capricorn energy but the devil is all about it's trying to tempt you and it's also about restrictions ten of air ten is completion now ten of air traditionally ten of swords would be about the the worst that something can be but it what it seems like here is like with these feathers it's like communication going out like a lot of it too, like a lot of communication. A lot of signs and synchronicities. Messenger of water. Look at how gorgeous these cards are. Somebody here confesses, speaks up about their feelings. You also might hear about it or they hear about it. Do you know that so-and-so likes you? Oh, I think so-and-so has a crush on you. Oh, I think you should be at so-and-so. feels like somebody else kind of tells them. Because you know how you have this seahorse here? It's almost like you have someone else that tells him something. You have the four of fire. This means twice you've had this type of an energy. Four of spring, four of fire, four of wands. It's marriage. It's union. It's commitment. Stability. The last card is the ace of fire the ace of wands and so it begins this is creativity this is movement this is action this is huge this could be a new relationship this could be a new job offer new business that you're starting something really creative though i, I know I, was, I wanted it to be the last card but i want to keep going six of fire some of you guys could be in the public eye because this is six of wands public recognition or being in the public eye. Some of you could land something that will make you famous. Remember you had the sun. The sun is fame and success too, right? 
some of you could be that's your person is a really famous successful person and you're like oh yeah right i'm gonna be with so and so yeah when fucking pigs fly like i said you better go check outside your window i think i saw a pig fly by some of you, it's you stepping into the limelight or becoming famous overnight, being well known overnight. Whether it's because you land this job or whether it's because you become TikTok famous. I just recently joined TikTok too. I love it. It's hilarious. XI underscore Missy underscore XI if you want to follow me there. Um, whether it's because you land this book deal and you and during quarantine you write this amazing story and you go freaking viral, you go famous. Like you're like the next freaking, you know, um, JK Rowling, you know, like something about success and it's going to be huge like all eyes on you huge like everyone knows your name where everyone knows your name like cheers y'all all right you guys thank you for all of your likes and your shares here on youtube thank you guys so very much and don't forget follow me on instagram xi underscore missy underscore xi and remember if you want to book a reading with me you must check what i offer first in the description box below and then shoot me an email and the title of the email is saying what it is you want now if you have a really big time difference of course because my clients are worldwide um sometimes you know if our schedules don't allow we need to do a recorded reading as opposed to a live just because of the way you know the time zones are set up so that's just a little fyi for some people um all right you guys i'll see you guys later hope you enjoyed this reading love you bye